Hello, welcome to day six of our 30 day Surya Namaskar challenge. Delighted to have you with me. Thank you so much for joining. So today we're going to do two slow salutations as we've done every day, staying in each position a few breaths. And then we're going to do six going through on the breath, one position, one breath. We'll do four straight through, have a few breaths, rest, and then we'll do the final two. All right, so if you're ready, come up to stand at the front of your mat and we'll begin. Feet together as much as you can, toes and heels. Feel the crown of your head drawing up towards the sky, shoulders relaxing down and back, settling into your breath. Right foot leading first round. Inhale, arms wide up to the sky. Lift and reach. Looking up. Udvasana. Exhale, stretch forwards and down into Hastapadasana. Placing your hands wherever they reach along your legs or the ground. Eventually, heel of the hands and feet in a line. Let your head drop. Shoulders relaxed. And then be still, just you and each breath. You can have a softening in your knees if you wish. Otherwise, legs straight, but not locked. With your next inhale, take your right foot back a large step. Place your knee down, point your toes back. Check your heel isn't dropping in or out. And make sure your left knee isn't overhanging your foot. It wants to be straight up from your heel to the back of your knee, so adjust your stance if needs be. You can be on your fingertips or the palms of your hands. Whatever's accessible for you is fine. Chin parallel to the ground and let your body sink down into your right thigh. Lovely, smooth breathing. Enjoy the pose. With your next exhale, tuck your right toes under, lift your knee, take your left foot back into plank. Keeping your body in a straight line. Make sure your head's not dropping down or lifting up. It wants to be an extension of your spine. Feel how strong you are here. And then bring your knees down, chest and chin or forehead down as you then inhale through to either sphinx on your elbows. Or if you're comfortable, onto your hands, into cobra, bhujangasana. Either way, roll your shoulders down and back away from your ears. Legs and buttocks relaxed. Chin parallel to the ground. Check your face is soft. Nice, smooth breathing. With your next exhale, tuck your toes under, lift your knees, send your hips back. Encouraging your heels down towards the ground, feet together, and your chest back towards your thighs. Letting your head drop down towards your mat, allowing your back to arch so your head can draw closer towards the ground.
With your next inhale, bring your right foot forward, left knee down, left toes pointing back. Either on your fingertips or your hands, whatever's comfortable for you today. Make sure your right knee isn't overhanging your foot. Straight up from your heel to the back of your knee. Chin parallel to the ground. Make sure you're not dropping your head. Letting your body sink down into your left thigh. Be with the stillness. Be with each breath. Then with your exhale, tuck your left toes under, bring your left foot forward, feet together, drop your head, soften your knees if you need to. Inhale, reach forwards up to the sky. And exhale, arms wide and down. And we'll rest a few breaths. Second round, left foot will lead. That means left foot will go back and forward. Check your shoulders are relaxing down. Inhale, arms wide up the sky, Udvasana. Reach high, look up. Next, exhale, reach forward, lengthen through your spine into Hastapadasana, hand to foot pose. Place your hands where they reach comfortably. Let your head drop. Shoulders relaxed. Soften your knees if you need to. Enjoying the stillness of the pose. Next inhale, take your left foot back a large step, place your knee down. Either onto your fingertips or the palms of your hand. Let your body sink down into your left thigh. Chin parallel to the ground. Tuck your left toes under, lift your knee, keep the body low as you take the right foot back into plank. Body straight and strong. Head and extension of your spine, check you're not dropping your head. And then Sashtanga, bring your knees down, chest and chin through to Bhujangasana. On your hands, or if you prefer, if it's more accessible for you, onto your elbows. Roll your shoulders back. Legs and buttocks relaxed. Chin parallel to the ground. Next, exhale into Buddhasana, tuck your toes under, lift your knees, send your hips back. Encourage your heels downward towards the ground, chest back towards your thighs. And then let your head drop down towards the ground.
Next inhale, bring your left foot forward. It wants to end up between your hands. Don't worry if it takes a few steps to get there. Right knee down, right toes pointing back. Body sinking down into the right thigh. It can be on the palms of your hands or your fingertips. Chin parallel to the ground. Next exhale, bring your right foot forward into Hastapadasana. Let your head drop. Shoulders relaxed. Settling into your position. Inhale, reach your arms forward, lift up to the sky. Exhale, arms wide and down. Just let everything relax. A lovely sense of letting go. Shoulders relaxing down and back. Face soft. Let your mind follow each breath. So we're going to do six salutations on the breath. We're going to do four, have a couple of breaths rest, and then we'll do the other two. Right foot leading, inhale, arms wide and up. Exhale, forwards and down. Inhale, right foot back, knee down. Exhale, into plank. Knees, chest, chin. Inhale through to cobra. Exhale, downward dog. Inhale, right foot forward, left knee down. Exhale, back foot forward, drop your head. Inhale, reach forwards and up. Exhale, arms wide and down. Inhale, up to Advasana. Exhale, Hastapadasana, left foot. Inhale, Ekapadasana. Exhale, Dwipadasana. Sashtanga. Inhale, through to Bhujangasana. Exhale, Buddhasana. Left foot. Inhale, Ekapadasana. Exhale, Hastapadasana. Inhale, Udvasana. Exhale, Samasthiti. Right foot leading this round. Inhale, Udvasana. Exhale, Hastapadasana. Inhale, Ekapadasana. Exhale, Dwipadasana. Sashtanga. Inhale, Bhujangasana. Exhale, Buddhasana. Right foot. Inhale, Ekapadasana. Exhale, Hastapadasana. Inhale, Udvasana. Exhale, Samasthiti, left foot leading. Inhale, Udvasana. Exhale, Hastapadasana. Inhale, Ekapadasana. Exhale, Dwipadasana, Sashtanga. Inhale, Bhujangasana. Exhale, Buddhasana. Left foot. Inhale, Ekapadasana. Exhale, Hastapadasana. Inhale, Udvasana. Exhale, Samasthiti. And just relax a few breaths. So let your body settle. Nice, nourishing, replenishing breaths. Preparing for the last two. Inhale, Udvasana. Exhale, Hastapadasana, right foot. Inhale, Ekapadasana. Exhale, Dwipadasana, Sashtanga. Inhale, Bhujangasana. Exhale, Buddhasana, right foot. Inhale, Ekapadasana. Exhale, Hastapadasana. Inhale, Udvasana. Exhale, Samasthiti. Left foot leading. Inhale, Udvasana. 
Exhale, Hasta Padasana. Inhale, Eka Padasana. Exhale, Dwi Padasana, Sashtanga. Inhale, Bhujangasana. Exhale, Buddharasana, left foot. Inhale, Eka Padasana. Exhale, Hasta Padasana. Inhale, Udvasana. Exhale, Samasthiti. And just let everything relax, shoulders dropped. Nice settling breath. Face soft. Just let go. And come to sit on your mat when you're ready. Good, well done. I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you so much for joining. Tomorrow we're going to up it a notch. We're going to do some variations within the salutation. So it'll be a bit more challenging tomorrow now that hopefully you're comfortable with what we're doing already. I look forward to seeing you next time. Namaste.